In this video, we are going to show you how to relight a pilot on your gas boiler. Uh, if you take the front cover off, there's the front cover of this boiler, you will see pilot lighting instructions. If you follow these instructions exactly, uh, you will be fine. Trust me, these instructions will, were written by very expensive lawyers to minimize liability for the manufacturer. So, it's very simple. On this gas valve, right now you see there's a little dot right there, it's on, but obviously we don't have a pilot, which would be right there. There's no pilot. We're gonna turn this to pilot, and we'll hold down this button. And then you'll take a flame, and you, while holding this down, and you will light, apply a flame right there. I am going to try to put this right there. Kelvin, hold the phone right there, please. And I, I do not have a barbecue lighter with me, so I'm going to use a flame. Now you see the pilot is lit. We are going to keep this depressed down, this knob. And when you push this down, you are pushing in or opening the pilot gas valve within this entire valve. And the pilot flame, which is right there, uh, is charging the thermal coupling, which is the copperish looking tube. The silver one is the pilot gas tubing. But the end of that thermal coupling is sitting in the pilot flame. And you, that flame is sending a small amount of electricity uh, a, down to millivolts. And when I let go of this knob, if that electricity is sufficient and the gas valve is, is functioning, uh, that the magnet inside will be held open and allowing the pilot valve to remain open. So I'm gonna let go of this and we'll see if the pilot stays on, which it does like that. And you would put the covers back on after turning this to on, which we're gonna do right now. And there you have it. We have main ignition. We're gonna follow up with a combustion analysis because I don't like that flame too much. It seems a little intense. I'm also questioning as if we're missing a guard in front of the, uh, right here. There is a screw there, but I wonder if there's a plate that normally would go there. But flame's looking a little too yellow. We're gonna do a combustion analysis. There's our test hole right there. And the last time we did one here was on October 11th, 2017. And I like to print the results. Take this out of the baggie. And you will see that on that day, we had a uh, stack temperature of 394.3 degrees Fahrenheit oxygen at 7.7%, carbon monoxide at two particles per, per million. So two years ago, this boiler was fine, but I think something is just not right with that. But we'll double check with our Compesto 320 combustion analyzer. But that's how you like the pilot. Um, this is for educational purposes only. Do not try this at home. Following my directions, you need to follow the pilot lighting instructions on the inside front cover. So number one, stop, read the safety information above on this label. Two, set the thermostat to the lowest setting. Three, turn off all electric power to the appliance. Four, depress the gas control knob slightly and turn clockwise to off. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Follow those instructions specifically and you'll be fine. If it doesn't light, you need to call a licensed or qualified heating professional. Thanks for watching.